Well, a great 800 final in store. Sarge will be on the inside. Lewandowski of Poland, Simmons of the United States, Suleiman of Djibouti, Solomon of the United States, Aman of Ethiopia, Mohammed of Saudi Arabia, and Boss of France. He's the number one in the world. Beat David Rudisha right at the beginning of the season. Rudisha, of course, missing with a knee injury. 800 final. Nick Simmons of the USA is a fast finisher. The likes of Lewandowski can finish quickly. The 1,500-meter man from Djibouti, Suleiman, will be a big danger. Everywhere you look, people with possibilities here, Brendan. An intriguing final. Solomon there to be shot out. He should go in the front. That's what we expect. His coach, Johnny Gray, used to do this, and Solomon is maybe, if anything, better than him at doing it. 23-53, a fast opening 200 meters, and we might have the Olympic champion David Rudisha, the world record holder, missing. But there's Andrew Asaji in the race, and it's great to have him in the race. But we've got the five fastest men in the world this year in the race, and there's the fastest, Dwayne Solomon. My question is, can the Ethiopian big favourite, Aman, can he go the rounds? Nick Simmons moving strongly, 50.2, and who's judged this one the right? I think Andrew Asaji has drifted to the foot in that position pretty comfortably and pretty well. 50 point is going to take something out of you. Solomon's going strongly. Simmons is following him, and a man coming under a little bit of pressure. The other man, Suleiman, moving quickly onto the outside. They're all there waiting to strike. Watch for Suleiman, the green figure on the outside. Aman's in the green vest on the inside of Ethiopia. He'll be strong in the home straight, but it's the two Americans. Asaji is coming, he's going to pass Boss, but he's a long way back at the moment. It's USA 1, USA 2, Solomon, Simmons, Aman, Suleiman. Then Mohammed on the inside, he's fading. Asaji trying to pick them up. Nick Simmons of the USA striking fast, but here comes Aman. Aman is trying to get there. He's the world number one. Simmons is number one in medal. He'll get it this time, but it's gold to Aman. Silver to Simmons. Suleiman takes the bronze. Asaji in fifth place. 143-3. And in the end, he's looked ragged in the heat. He looked tired in the semi-final. He is the world's number one this year, and he is now the world champion. Aman of Ethiopia timed it perfectly. And well done, Nick Simmons. He's been to these championships many times. He's never won a medal. He, he should be happy with the medal, but you know, Brendan, I think he probably thought he could win it. Asaji's done very well. He's done brilliantly to get himself into this final and to run well in the final because he's had all sorts of injury problems leading up to this. But I suppose in the end, in the end, all season long, we shouldn't be surprised that it's Aman who's come out on top. Well, he is the world champion. The season's best for him, 143.31. Simmons ran really well, 143.55. Suleiman, watch out for him in the 1500 meters. And then the Europeans, Lewandowski and Andrew Asaji with an excellent fifth place. He's with Phil.